exactly what time it is. Hi, sweetheart. I know, don't you bite my shoes? We do this every day. So I assume some of you are here for the two o'clock. Yes, wonderful. We do the presentations every day at 8.30 a.m. and 2 p.m. Some of you just ended up here at the right time at the right place. Some of you have no idea how you got here. I don't know where you are. It happens every day. No judgment here at Vegas. <laughs> My name is Jackie. I'm one of the three ladies who work in the wildlife department. We take care of all of these birds, fish, and turtles. You're just in time for Bugsy's last feed of the day. We did not teach him to do these pelican zoomies. Uh, he does this all on his own. Bugsy lives with us because he is permanently damp. <laughs> As you can see when he opens up that enormous wingspan. We don't own Bugsy. California brown pelicans are protected here in this country. We have a special educational permit from the government to display him here as an educational ambassador for his species. Right now, he is the only pelican that we have. He is a bachelor. So we've been waiting for some good news for quite some time now. So we do have high hopes in about a month or so, he will have a lady friend. We are very happy to hear that. Get that one down the right way? You don't want that one? No? Different one? Same fish? Yes? Okay. So we are looking forward to his girlfriend arriving here with us. He will no longer be a single boy. He is tired of living the single life. He does have lots of other, of course, animal friends here. But we do want to have, for him to have a species of his own. If you look in the back of his exhibit, for those of you on that side, you can get a lot of questions about the mirrors. We have them on Flamingo Island as well. We use them a lot in our field for animal enrichment and mental stimulation. So that's where he sees all of his other pelican friends in the back of his exhibit. So he does spend most of his time back there. No, you're just playing with your food? Yes? All right, I'm gonna come down there with you. Can you move? Thank you. <laughs> Bugsy is on a measured diet, and we do count out every single fish for him for every feeding. He could not have an endless seafood buffet like all of you. We want you all eat here like you've never seen food before, or adult beverages. Vegas is a very interesting city. Wait, me first. Don't you bite my shoes. Bugsy is very spicy during feeding time. Okay, all right. And he is clumsy. Sometimes he trips over his own two feet, often. And sometimes he will barf up his fish for you if he fancies you. In his role, that is sharing is caring. There's nothing wrong with him. Tripping and barfing. He imitates our guest here very, very well. All right, good boy. As I was saying right now, he is the only pelican that we have, but hopefully his girlfriend will be here in about a month. Lots of hurdles for us to jump through when we get other pelicans. We can't just get one. We have to wait for one in a situation like Bugsy here from a rescue rehab facility or similar. Every single pelican we've had living with us for the past 10 years since we've had our permit to display these protected birds has come to live with us because of permanent wing damage from fishing line and fishing net entanglement. So from all of us here, especially our feathered friends. We do encourage you to be as earth friendly as you can throughout the daily lives. This is our planet, we have to take care of it. Nobody else is gonna do that job for us, right? We all live on this big ball. Our oceans, lakes, rivers, streams should not be garbage disposals for all of our human trash. Nowadays, you can buy almost everything reusable. So of course, we do encourage you to 